One type of ad I love for my e-commerce clients are carousel ads. This gives users the option to swipe through various images of your products, of your services. So for anybody with a lot of products, a lot of great photos, carousel ads are a great option for this. I also like to use carousel ads as a quick way to A-B split test which image is getting the most clicks. So to view these insights and reports for which carousel image is doing the best, you want to go to your ads manager and then click that carousel ad. Once on that ad page, click the columns drop down and select carousel engagement. So as you can see, we run ads manager, I click the campaign, here's the campaign name, then I click the ad set, and now we are at the ad level. So at the ad level, click columns, and here is carousel engagement. So this is going to output reporting specific to this ad type. Remember, feel free to browse all these Facebook reporting column layouts. I personally prefer the metrics in the performance and engagement columns. But depending on your ad type, you may want to customize the columns to display metrics you prefer for your specific ads. But for carousel ads, click the carousel engagement option. So by selecting this reporting option, we can break it down even further by clicking the breakdown menu, then selecting by action, and then selecting carousel card. So like I said, we can A, B, split test by each card. So here we go. I've named each card in this specific ad, and I can scroll right and see which one's getting the most clicks for me. So by doing this, you can evaluate which card in the carousel is performing the best. So for my clients, I like to use carousel ads for new products and new services so I can quickly identify which one audiences are most receptive to. Then you can do a single image ad and put more budget behind that product or service via the single image or video ads catering to that product that did the best in the carousel ads.